Grief, frustration, loneliness, guilt, even chronic physical pain can feel like more than a person can bear. A person thinking about suicide may see death as an escape from the feeling that life is nothing but torture that is never going to end. However, there are other choices that can make life worth living. Depression is not a mood. It is a real condition that changes the way the brain works. People can take steps to address the issues of depression, stress, or loss that have made them feel hopeless. The first step is talking to someone. A person who is in despair may feel powerless to find a solution, but there is power in being able to share our burdens with someone who can be trusted to take us seriously. If you are the person who someone is reaching out to, show respect, listen willingly, and do not be hurt by the sharing of honest feelings. The list of people to consider talking to may include a family physician, a friend, a member of the clergy, a teacher, a co-worker, or other person with whom you feel comfortable. If there is no one who fits this category, the National Suicide Prevention Foundation provides a lifeline crisis chat service for anyone needing to talk. It is available 24-7. The link to this service can be found on our webpage. If discussions with trusted individuals do not resolve the state of depression and despair, professional assistance is available through private and public practitioners in psychiatry, psychology, social work, and counseling. These people may be contacted through family physicians, crisis centers, community mental health centers, hospital emergency rooms, and insurance provider listings. Local chapters of mental health support organizations such as Mental Health America and the National Alliance on Mental Illness may be helpful. Long-term depression is characterized by a loss of all joy for life, loss of enthusiasm for anything, loss or gain of significant amounts of weight, listlessness, oversleeping or insomnia, isolation from others, reliance on alcohol or drugs, and difficulty concentrating or focusing. Major depression will not be resolved by talk alone. For this type of depression, medication may be required to put the body back in balance. As the depression begins to lift, normal patterns of activity, sleep, enjoyment, appetite, memory, and thinking skills will return. Remember, when thoughts turn to suicide, it may be valuable to talk to someone you trust. Be honest about what you have really been feeling. Make a promise to yourself and to someone else that you will not do anything drastic. Make an appointment with a mental health professional. Cut back on alcohol and other drugs immediately. They actually deepen your depression. If someone is talking about killing himself or herself, one of the best things you can do is find them professional help immediately. Talking about the issues involved in a person's depression or asking whether the person is suicidal will not lead to the suicidal act. It may help him or her to step back and gain hope again.